No! No! No, 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 no! What is this dark sorcery? Brute! Back, foul demon! Jeez! Oh. Oh, uh... I am Whoa! Brute! Hey! This is not normal! Get behind me! I will protect you from this monstrosity. Are you trying to kill me? Again? I'm sorry, I panicked. How are you... Yeah, so, uh... I guess I was dead, and now uh, apparently I'm not. This is impossible. Impossible is one thing. This? <laughs> this is freaky. How do we know you are really Peter Quill? Prove it to me. What do you expect him to do? If he is really Peter Quill, he will know. Oh, come on, buddy. You know me. We, uh, we shared a drink. Or whatever that disgusting liquid was. Back on nowhere. Come on. You remember? <laughs> Your face. You were choking. <laughs> oh, how we laughed. Okay, great. Everybody calm now? Huh? We cool? No! I am Groot. He's right. The dead don't just come back. There's gotta be a catch. I mean, this is insane. You see that, don't okay, you? Okay, Rocket, just... Everything comes at a cost. Hey, I'm just happy to be alive, okay? Screw the cost. You don't know anything about this thing, Pete. What if it's temporary? Huh? Well, what if it does something to you? Yeah, easy to say screw the cost when you don't know what that is, you idiot. What was that? It's Hala. She's caught up to us. Everyone upstairs, we gotta move. I already died once today. I really don't want to try it again. Everyone, hold on. Things are gonna get a little bumpy. Yeah, that'll help. Peter, you just died. Are you sure you're okay to fly? We get it almost every night. Easy, when well, the moon gets that answer your question? Bright, <laughs> Not really. Delight, I am. Who says he's gonna puke again? <laughs> <laughs> Everybody here is out of sight but They don't bark and they don't bite They keep things loose they keep... I think we lost her This Hala lady's relentless Why she want this eternity thing so bad? Her ship was full of dead Kree Thousands of them preserved in stasis pods. Uh, okay. Uh, now I might puke. Save it for when we land, buddy. She could create an unlimited army of Kree soldiers. If this relic falls into Hollis' hands, that's bad news. For everybody. Agreed. Although I would relish in killing her. And then bringing her back to life. And then killing her again. And then bringing her back to life. And then killing her again. And then bringing her back to life, and We get it, Drax. Ah, now that will be a fair fight. One I would not lose. You know, I'm all for people having opinions, but sometimes Drax shouldn't be allowed to speak. Ah, <sighs> well, it's been nice knowing you all. People coming back to life, an undead army. Yeah, <laughs> we're facing the end of days, folks. It is. If we just sit here... Milano can't take much more of this, Pete. I barely got her up and running after your last so-called landing. If we don't find some place to lay low and fix our yeah, ship... Yeah, I'm on it. Look, I just need her to hold together for a little longer, Rocket. I might know someone who can help us out. like being out in the open with Hala on our trail. Let me do the talking. Will? If you're here, 
probably far behind. My ship's busted, man. And you're the only guy who can fix it. <sighs> and this is why you never loan stuff to people. Haven't seen you since you left me in the ravages. Heard you got in bed with the Collector. Which is exactly why I can't trust you no more. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. I'm proud of you for taking after me. Just open the door already, Yondu. We don't have time to wait around all night. Well, you better come on in then before someone sees you. Make yourself right at home? Oh! I thought it was just you, Quill. Not all your little playmates. Hey, hey! No plants on the roof! These are my friends, Yandu. Great! Okay, quick introductions then. This is Gamora. Say now. Nice to meet you. Put that away, or I'll cut it off. That's Groot. Drax, say hi. These are terrible. What do you think you're doing? That's my food! Mine! A warrior must eat. And last but not least, Rocket. R rocket! I don't trust Ravages, Quill. They'll shoot you in the back the first moment they get. Well, I don't trust animals that can talk. Wanna hear me talk? Okay. Yondu! Put that arrow back in your pants, man! Look, Rocket's just a little sensitive, because everyone's been trying to kill us lately. Well, you can add me to the list. <laughs> oh, that is... Oh, that just is his face! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I've been buying black market trinkets off this little freak for years. And I've been gladly accepting this idiot's money. You got anything new for me? Oh, we got some. But it ain't for sale. Well, ain't she a beaut? Fit it right in with my collection. Could clear some space. I know how much you like shiny stuff, but that one, it's mine. And calm yourself, Quill. I'm just having a look. Beautiful. Sometimes it takes stepping back from your problems to see how small they actually are. These last few months haven't been easy. For either of us. But, um... I'm not always gonna be here. I worry about you. You're growing up so fast. Uh... Why am I here again? I already saw this. Maybe you didn't see all of it. You're meant for more than this life, Peter. I know you are. You're gonna save the galaxy. You're gonna kill Thanos. And change everything. Stop it! Stop messing with my head! I wish I could. But there's no other way. I'm trying to help you. Every time I look up there, I find something new. Something I overlooked. Come sit by me, baby. Hmm? You can see the stars even better from over here. Peter, please. Just for a little bit. Yeah, of course, Mom. Just for a minute, though, okay? That's good. So, what am I supposed to be looking at? The stars. I know they don't look like much. That's Orion. No doubt about it. 
It is indeed. First constellation you ever learned. That's, uh, that's Gemini, right? The twins? Yep. You used to say they were dancing together. Yeah. I thought it was you and, and Dad. You have one active imagination, Peter. I think that one is Canis Major. It's shaped like a dog. That's right. You wanted a pup so badly when you were younger. But you could never have one. Too much money. Closest thing you were ever gonna get was that constellation. You used to wish that dog sweet dreams every single night. That looks like the Eternity Forge. Sure does. Look closer. That writing. It wasn't there before. What... what does it say? Mom? Come find me, Peter. Guys! I don't think they can hear us. Did you just see what I saw? It's been decades since I've seen your mama's face. Now that was a special tree. Peter? Something was off about that memory. That wasn't how the night ended. Can't help you. I wasn't there the first time. What just happened? I saw my mom. You heard her, right? She wants me to find her. Wait, look. I've seen glyphs like that before. It's ancient Cree. Stop eating already! God, I can't hear myself think. Where have you seen these symbols before? It was a long time ago. Thanos was after something. An object with these same markings. Let me see that. Nebula and I stole it for him. I don't know what it does, but my sister may have been able to learn something from it. If we can find Nebula, maybe she can help us translate this. Yeah, right before she cuts off all our heads and takes the forge for herself. And who do you think's the first guy she's gonna use it on? Counterpoint? You worry too much. We have to figure this out before Hala does. Are you hearing yourself? Every story you tell us about that robo-chick ends with somebody getting eviscerated. And that is something I'd like to avoid for the foreseeable future. You know, ever since I was a kid, I've wanted to fight a cyborg. I mean, guess dreams do come true. Sorry to crush your dreams, but we might not have to fight her. Oh, you're no fun. I tried to get in contact with Nebula not long ago. She won't be hard to track down. Better let me have a look at your ship, then. I may have something to fix that lying around. Move your foot. I am Groot. Somebody get this tree away from me. <sighs> Enough <sighs> with the snacks! Could you be any more useless right now? What's up, man? Is everything okay? Look, 
I'm no good at this, so I'm just gonna do it fast. I know we don't know a ton about the relic, but the one thing we do know is that it brought you back to life. Now don't tell me you ain't thought about how you can use that power. My mom. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You don't know a lot about me. But before I met you guys, there was someone. She's gone now, but maybe with that relic I can make her... ungone. I just... I have to try. We gotta go to half world people. I know going after Nebula is the logical move here. I get it. We gotta find out why this thing's affecting you. But this favor... I gotta ask. Rocket. I wish we could, but... We need Nebula to translate the symbols on the relic. That's more important right now. Yeah, more important to you. That's what you meant to say. I didn't mean it like that. Well, that's how it's coming out of your stupid mouth. Whatever. Find my own way to get there. Rocket! Help me out with this, boy! Your friend over here keeps dropping it on my foot! It slipped. That little furball of yours give her a good rev to warm up the engines. Should be right to go. Rocket! What the? That's my ship! Rocket. He has the Eternity Forge. Mind telling me what's going on? Rocket wanted to go to Half World to take care of something. I told him no. He doesn't do well with no. You best get your people in order, Quill. Peter, there's something you need to see. I found Nebula. She's taken Thanos' ship. She's heading towards the Collector's Museum on Nowhere. Peter, she's going after Thanos' body. I'm missing the part where you say why this is more important than getting my wings back. Then we have to get to her before she gets away. We can't lose track of her again. We'd better hurry. What? You're gonna go chasing after some cyborg instead of getting my damn ship back? We need her to help us translate the Eternity Forge. Nebula isn't going to just wait for us to intercept her. I want my ship back, boy. Oh, your ship can wait, Yondu. Nebula is dangerous. We can't risk losing her. While that little pipsqueak cannibalizes parts off my engine? I don't think so. Translating the relic is our priority right now. We're going after Nebula. Whenever you're ready, we'll head out. You better owe me for this, boy. If that mangy little rodent messes up my ship, you'll be the one paying for it. We're going to the Collector's Museum to intercept Nebula. You better get my ship back soon. Hala has found us. And this is what we call great timing.
you're doing. I appreciate your enthusiasm, but the Thanos exhibit isn't ready to see it. Where's Nebula? Has she shown up yet? What are you talking about? <laughs> no. No, no, no. This can't be happening if the Collector finds out. No. Happy thoughts. He won't find out because you are going to go in there and fix this and everything is going to be wonderful and nobody will get tortured. <sighs> okay. The power is priceless. Don't break anything. Okay. If we want the forge translated, we need to get Nebula on the Milano, no matter what. We have to talk her down. If this turns into a fight, it's going to get ugly. Nebula! I thought I made it clear when you called. Stay away from me. There's nothing left to say. Nebula! Please stop! Let's talk- I'm done talking! Look at him. Look what your pathetic Star-Lord did. He was all I had. And you took him from me! daughter and now I will never hear I have nothing we are not 
beholden to him anymore, Nebula. Come with us. We can fix this animosity between us. We can be sisters again. I want to be sisters again. Yeah, but just so we're clear, this is temporary. We need information, that's all. But you'll be safe. Get her up. Sorry about the mess. When I get out of these chains! <laughs> yeah, I don't see that happening anytime soon. Uh. We got her. Yeah, we did. Let her sit in there for a little while. We can get her to talk after she cools down for a bit. Now, can we get my ship back from that furball friend of yours? We'll need the relic so Nebula can translate it. Yeah, we're going after Rocket. Just hope he's still there. Better not wreck my ship. Mom would have loved to see the stars from up here. Who has been eating all this candy? Oh, yes! Rocka must have got to work it again. Hey, Drax. Hello, Quill. How's our new friend? You use the term friend far too loosely. The cyborg is very quiet, but do not worry. She is secure. Funny how alien all my earth junk starts to look after a while. Uh, Peter. What's up? I know this hasn't been easy for you. What with Nebula and Rocket, the Eternity Forge. You dying and coming back to life. I just... You know you can talk to me, right? If anything's bothering you. I... I know this is all, um... <clears throat> well, I know it's a lot. <laughs> Nothing's bothering me. Everything's just peachy. Uh-huh. I'm sure everyone that comes back from the dead is that chipper. I hope you know that I'm always here for you. No matter what. Heads up, everyone. We're going after Rocket. Finally!
Rocket! Rocket. Rocket, let me... Let me help you. You had your chance! Just back off! Subject seems to be responding well to the program. Vital signs are good. Still no rejection of the artificial vertebrae or neural implants. The only one who wasn't a total failure. Everything rests on you, my little friend. Rocket. You okay? I heard you screaming in there. These walls aren't exactly soundproof. That guy. Ugh, I just want to bite him in his stupid little face. Tried that once. It did not end well. Tasted terrible, too. So, did you get it? You mean this? <laughs> Wait, it's the right one, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, that's it. Once that computer's finished, we can finally break out of here. Advanced security. Supposedly unhackable blast doors. Piece of cake, right? You sound worried. Hey, you can do this. Just stick to the plan. It's gonna work. I won't let you down, Lila. I know. Catch! Nice. You're making this look way too easy. Power source. Designed by yours truly. Okay, moment of truth. Go ahead and hook it up to the underside. Ah! Ugh, stupid piece of junk. You know your ear twitches when you're frustrated, right? It's cute. Yeah, hilarious, Lila. You mind helping me out? Come on, you don't need my help. Why do you keep doing that with your face? It's called smiling. You should try it sometime. Happy? <laughs> now, all I need is a display and we're in business. Network. I keep having that dream. Still? I'm outside again, in the fresh air somewhere. It's warm, bright. Can't... It felt so real. 
I can barely remember. It's been so long. That's a nice dream, Lila. I promise you'll see it again. Just you wait. Spent our whole lives waiting. We have to get these cages open. There should be a hallway just outside that door. From there, we make a break for the main entrance. When I get out, I'm gonna find that place. And I want you to come with me. We'll find the river. I know it's gotta be out there. I'm going wherever you're going, lady. We'll find home somewhere. Hide it, quick! Subject 89P14. Still no progress. <sighs> Begin prepping lethal injection. Rocket? I can't. I can't lose you. I'm not letting him do anything to you. You understand? Rocket, I... Lila! Lila! Gotta move. We're so close! You have to make it, Rocket! There you are! Yeah. Kill them! I'll create a distraction. Buy you time to get out. I can still cause a little chaos before it kicks in for good. I might as well try to take a few of them down with me, right? You go, Rocket. They'll be sorry for what they did to us. No, no, you're not dying. I won't let this happen. Please, don't make this any worse than it has to be. Survive, Rocket. Rocket. 
No, no, come on. Don't you leave me. Never. I never told you. I... Lila? No, no, Lila. <laughs> what just... You had no right to see that. Those are my memories, not yours. Least you could do is say something. Guess you're happy, huh? It didn't even work. Come on. You did what you could, Rocket. Now it's time to go. Useless piece of junk! Just take it. It's what you came for anyway. Still hope, Rocket. We'll find a way to bring her back. I don't want to talk about it. No, 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 no. Come on. Please don't do this. I gotta go. She's been doing that since you left. We're running a scan of her cybernetics, but it's taking some extra time. Just to be safe. We need to get Nebula to help us decipher these symbols. Just watch yourself, Peter. She's not exactly happy to be here. Okay, she's definitely not happy to be here. Yeah, I don't really blame her. Her dad's dead, we beat her up, and then she gets locked in her sister's room. She's not having the best couple of days. It is what she deserves for serving Thanos. Rocket may be able to get her arm working again. We could use it as leverage. <laughs> Don't bother. We are going to dismantle this cyborg piece by piece. Fear won't work on someone like Nebula. You'll just rile her up. <laughs> good. Not good. She was trained to slaughter thousands. She may hate you, but she does not fear you. I know you're good at knives, but trust me. You attract more flies with honey. What would you want with flies? That's not the point. Flies are a nuisance. You okay to go in there? Frankly, no. I'm not okay. I wanted to reconnect with Nebula. You told me to reconnect with her. And then this happens. Maybe she'll come around someday, but I can't see her wanting to reconcile anytime soon.
Hey, Nebula. Neb, can I call you Neb? Oh, oh hey, 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 do you mind not inviting me? I just want to talk like two civilized people. Can we do that? That's really up to you, isn't it? Thanos wanted this relic. And I know he had you learn how to read these glyphs. That, that's the Eternity Forge. You've heard of it? How did you make those runes appear? I thought it didn't work. I have, like, zero reasons to tell you that. Like, none at all. I was under the impression you wanted my help. I need you to help me translate them. That's not gonna happen. You think I'd so easily betray my father? Okay. What if I sweeten the deal? Look, you help me with this one teensy tiny little thing and I will let Rocket reattach your arm. I know you have no intention of helping me. She wants to see me suffer. Killing our father wasn't enough for you, you have to rub it in my face too. He raised you, Gamora. He loved you. That was not love, Nebula. And you let this imbecile murder him! You are the reason he's gone. You're the one who ruined my life. Whoa, this is a happy place. There's no need for that kind of name calling. I mean, really, imbecile? Oh, sorry I hurt your delicate little feelings. That's enough, Nebula! You pass judgment on me, on my father, but I know you, Gamora. You may have forgotten Tarval, but I haven't. I'm warning you, never, never to speak the name! Tarval, Tarval! I'll get what we need from you, one way or another. You want me to talk? Get rid of her! Don't be ridiculous, Nebula! I have nothing to say to you. I'll make you talk. You know I can. Gamora? You need to leave. What? Now. If I hear screams, I'm not helping you. She never cared about us. The minute things get difficult, she'll be gone. You'll see. I did what you asked. You owe me now. I said I would talk. You've done one decent act for me, out of several despicable acts. I'm not keen on granting you any favors. Star-Lord, the scan found something. A strange device in the cyborg's skull. These past few days... They've been the worst of my life. I lose my father. Then you show up and capture me and I'm forced to relive everything. Just leave me alone. I'm not trying to hurt you, Nebula. Doesn't matter, does it? You still did. But maybe there's a way to fix that. Oh, God. No, what are you, what are you doing? I know you won't take my word for it. So here, it'll tell you what you need to know. You owe me. Thanks, Nebula. Almost. I told myself I wasn't going to be that person anymore. She just gets under my skin. I can't help it. You two clearly have some issues you need to work out. I'll try. Maybe without weapons this time. I see you tried my plan. <sighs> the important thing is we got the, uh, the Kree thingy, so... Oh, that is a cipher module. There are not many left in existence. All right, so how does this work? I think I can upload this to my own translator. Okay, it says, come find me in the temple. Helpful. Did we find it in a temple? My mom said the same thing when I died. But maybe we missed something. We were a little preoccupied at the time. Come find me. Who do you think me is? That temple was completely abandoned when we showed up. Except for all the dead Novacore bodies that Thanos put there. 
It's gotta be my mom. If you think it is, then I hope you're right. Let's get moving. We're going back to the temple. Where's Rocket? We're almost there. I have not seen him emerge. We should give Rocket some space. Okay, let him be for now. Fine. Well, Rocket is in no shape to guard Nebula. Someone's got to stay back and keep an eye on her. I will stay behind to guard the prisoner. Um, hang on. No, you won't. I am not leaving him here with her. You heard him before. He wants to rip her apart. I trust Drax. He's not gonna let anything bad happen. Right, Drax? Come on, help me out, buddy. How do you define bad? You're the one who told me to reconnect with her. Now that she's here, I deserve that opportunity. And I'll make sure she stays out of trouble. Nebula is my responsibility. Your record on that matter is questionable. Gamora, you should stay behind and keep an eye on Nebula. Maybe it'll give you a chance to talk. Thank you, Peter. You... you side with her again, Peter Quill. Perhaps I truly have no purpose. Let us return to the temple. I will be ready when you are. I am Groot. Find me in the temple. Let's go find out who's waiting for us. I, uh... <laughs> I forgot how slow this elevator was. I do not like being back in this wretched place. Well, this ain't a field trip, Drax. The markings on the forge said, find me in the temple. So, here we are. In a temple. Again. Hello? Anyone here? Yes, I am here. As is Groot. But I should be guarding Nebula on the ship. We've been over this, Drax. So, why don't we just spread out? Look for secret doors, or passages, or whatever. I've got my scanner, if anyone's here. We'll find them. Well, these footprints are fresh. Man, Thanos really packed a punch. <laughs> I still can't believe we all survived that fight. I am Groot. Quill, I apologize for my outburst on the ship. However, I should have been the one to guard the cyborg instead of Gamora. Gamora has too much of an attachment to her sister. This mission here is super important, Drax. I needed you by my side. No other place I'd want you to be. I couldn't let you guard Nebula and come on this mission. Can't have your cake and eat it too, you know. You are right. I could not do both. I just wanted to share my thoughts. And I am confident. I would be able to eat many cakes.
Let's get back to it. Hey, how's it going up there? Not now, Pete. Come on, Rockets. Okay, this is gonna sound like I'm hanging up, cause I'm hanging up. More footprints over here. Well, this is where Thanos found the Eternity Forge. Hey, Gamora. How's it going with Nebula? About as well as I expected. She's been pretty quiet so far. Well, that's... good, I guess. Better than the alternative. Looks like Thanos' armor. Didn't exactly protect him. Good. It is a comfort to know the Mad Titan was mortal after all. Sorry, I gotta do something real quick. Hey, Groot. Have you seen anyone around who seems like they might know what an Eternity Forge is? I am Groot. Oh, something over there I should look at? Well, thanks, Groot. Keep up the good work. Someone's been busy in here. There's still more footprints. she doing here? Star-Lord! It's Hala! Oh my god! Oh god! Why? I saved you. That was a hologram, you big dope! Look! Her hand is going... through the wall? There's something behind here. Hello? Anybody home? Checking in. Anything new to report? Nebula is finally talking to me. That's new. Thanks for giving us this opportunity. Absolutely. Now what is she doing? Whatever they were trying to do, looks like they needed the forge to do it. Score one for the good guys. I am Groot!
see what you were doing over here. Where did they go? They went up. Looks like some kind of button. Okay, so much for that. Button on this one. Huh. Nothing from this one either. from this one either. Whatever they're doing, looks like they're doing it at the same time. What is it, Quill? You see that bad boy? He does not seem particularly ill-tempered. Uh, look, whatever, fine. Just press the button on his helmet when I say so, okay? You okay? Okay, one, two, three. What happened? You went early. No, I didn't. One, two, three, go. I was waiting for the go. Oh, fine. One, two, three, go. And it's Christmas. Check this out. That definitely looks like the Eternity Forge. And those souls are being absorbed by it. That's why it didn't work for Rocket. It wasn't charged. Look at this. Here is where Hala failed. No Eternity Forge, no prize. Here goes nothing. Whoa. What does it say? Hang on. Let's see if Nebula's Cypher was worth all the trouble. The Eternity Forge resides here, pending such time as it can be wielded responsibly. Until then, she shall remain entombed across the galaxy. Huh. So, this is not the correct temple. We came here for nothing. Hang on a second, there's more. 
It says... Emnios? The temple we're looking for is on a place called... Emnios. The symbols are a star Ha! <laughs> I know how to get there! Gamora! Peter! Whoever we're looking for isn't here, but we figured out where to find him. Get those engines fired up. We're going for a ride. Um, about that. Rocket's down in the engine room. He's uh, yelling some new and creative curse words. Yeah, you might want to talk to him. Look, I know you miss Lila. That's okay. <laughs> I don't... I don't... <laughs> I should... Uh, go get Groot. He... <laughs> He'd be better at this. No. Don't. She's gone. She was the only thing keeping me alive. And I couldn't save her. She protected me. And I couldn't... You can't blame yourself for what happened. It's not your fault. I keep telling myself that, <sighs> but I don't know. I thought if I could just get her out of there, if she could just see it. This is all I have left of her. This stupid computer. I can't do this without her, Pete. I thought I could, but I can't. I can't. I can't lose her again. I can't fix it this time. There's nothing left. I, I still can't. I don't want to give her up. That's all I got. It's time to let go of it, Rocket. For good. I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> going on get the eternity forge keep it safe go help rocket what are you gonna do You two. Not fair. How about some fresh air? Oh, that's right. There's no air in space. Oops. Wait! Let me fight. You trapped me on this piece of junk and now we're surrounded by pissed off Kree. I don't want to die here and neither do you. If you keep me here, they'll kill you, your friends, and then they'll come for me too. Let me out. Without me, you're just gonna get us all killed. Okay, but one move against my crew. Any of them gets hurt and this little trust exercise is over. Do you understand? I understand. Heads up! Oh, these irksome invisible enemies. 
You okay? Trax! Not okay. Hurry! Gamora! I should have guessed Nebula wouldn't pass up the chance to fight. Well, someone on this ship has to keep you all alive. Here! This one's yours! like old times, isn't it? <sighs> Never gets any easier. Ah! We've got to move. Now! <sighs> Couldn't have said it better myself. And that is the engine room. Rocket! Nebula and I will keep the bridge secure. Just get the power back on. I am uh, Root. Right. Engine room. Rocket! Ah! <sighs> Think you could possibly win against the Kree? Now that I've obtained the Eternity Forge for Hala. Ah, oh, stop, dude. Just, just stop. I really don't care. How dare you speak to me like that? How dare I? Mm. <laughs> you come onto my ship, you bust up my team, and then you go about spouting your evil plan like a bad monster movie? Hold your tongue! Hala will! Well, Hala can kiss my beautiful Earth ass! Here, catch! You'll like it. Oh, that was entertaining. You must think you're clever, Peter Quill, but you can't run forever. The forge will be mine. Do not be foolish. Who says I'm running? Is there another word you would prefer? Hiding. Cowering. I'm not afraid of you. I do not need you to be afraid. <sighs> Peter, you better get the engines running. The Revenant's weapons are coming online. Rocket, I'm on it. Gamora, set a course for Emneos. Drop off our stowaways on the way there. Mom is down there. I 
I hope she is. I hope I'll get to see her again. Talk to her. I hope so too. So, if you can bring her back, what then? You still going to be doing this? The Guardians? I don't know. I guess I hadn't really thought that far ahead yet. Yeah. It's uh, not a normal thing to think about. This is it. So, what now? I'm sure Peter has a plan. You do have a plan, right? I know what I'm doing, guys. Trust me. Can't argue with that. <laughs> 